Hello! In today's video, we are going to be talking about delays and queues. The delay node's main purpose is to hold resources for an amount of time before pushing them forward. They are excellent for cooldown or building type mechanics. You can find delays in the node overview tab as a circle with an hourglass inside. Delays have two action modes, delay and queue. Q is represented by a circle with two hourglasses inside. Delays store the amount of resources on the input connection for the specified number of steps on the output connection. It also works when multiple resources are sent in during the same step. Q nodes are similar to delays, but in addition to holding the resources, they let resources out one by one at the interval specified on the output connection. Even when multiple resources enter a queue during the same step, they still come out one by one. One example of queue usage would be troop training mechanics. One other important thing to note is that both delays and queues can have multiple inputs but a single output. Delays hold any incoming resources for the amount specified on the output connection, while queues send resources forward in the order in which they entered the queue. To sum up, both delays and queues are nodes used to hold resources in for a specified amount of steps before pushing them forward. In our next video, we will be talking about end conditions.